Hello students. Today we will revise and understand more about Roman numerals. We know that the ancient Roman used letters to write numbers. Even today, building date on monuments and public buildings is marked in Roman numerals. We also use Roman numerals in clocks and watches. Here are the letters used to write the numbers. You can see this table. The symbol I is equal to 1. V is equal to 5. X is equal to 10. L is equal to 50. C is equal to 100. D is equal to 500. And M is equal to 1000. We need to remember and learn three rules while writing the Roman numerals. First, rule of repetition. Second, rule of addition. And the third, rule of subtraction. Let us learn each rule one by one. Rule one, rule of repetition. First, when a symbol is repeated twice or thrice, its value is multiplied by two or three respectively. You can see this table. M is stand as 1000 M M 1000 multiplied by 2 equal to 2000 M M M means 1000 multiplied by 3 equal to 3000 now the second symbol I X C and M can be repeated three times at maximum. Now again, you can see this table. One stand for only I, two I I, three I I I. But four we cannot write I I I I means four we cannot write as four times i now third symbol v l and d are never repeated means symbols for five fifty and five hundred can't be repeated you can see the table again we cannot write ten 5, 5 means V and V. We have to write 10 as X. Now, let us look at the second rule of addition. If a symbol of smaller value is written to the right of a symbol of higher value, we add the smaller value to the greater value. Hello student. Let us consider xi. x has a value of 10 and i has the value of 1. So the Hindu Arabic number for this Roman number is 11. Finally, we have the third rule. Rule 3. Rule of subtraction. 1. If a symbol of a smaller value is to the left of a symbol of a higher value we subtract the smaller value from the higher value for example let us take a number x c x has a value of 10 and c has the value of 100 so x c will be 100 minus 10 equal to 90 2 the symbols V, L and D cannot be subtracted from any number. For example, 95 cannot be written as 100 minus 5 equal to V, C. 95 should be written as 90 plus 5 
equal to x c v. Now, if larger Roman numerals are given, how do we read and write them? Look at example one. What is m c m x x x i equal to? Keeping in mind the rules explained earlier, we first write this number into thousands, hundreds, tens, and ones as m plus c m plus x x x plus i. In order to solve in further, now let us write down the value of the respective numbers. The value of m is equal to 1000. Cm is 1000 minus 100 which is equal to 900. x x x is 10 plus 10 plus 10 which is equal to 30 and lastly the value of i is equal to 1 on adding 1000 plus 900 plus 30 plus 1 we get the answer as 1000 931. Now let us look at the another example. Write 3817 in Roman numerals. We first write the number 3817 in expanded notation which is 3000 plus 800 plus 10 plus 7. Now write the Roman values of each that is 3000 as m m m 800 as d c c c 10 as x and 7 v i i which is equal to m m m d c c c x v i i now this way we can get our result also wow it was so much fun to learn roman numerals i think and i hope you understood roman numerals nicely thank you now the strengths this time this time is for your uh, brain teachers now you have to solve these assignments do these practice you have to solve these questions and just give the answers